Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal on Monday skipped the seven summons issued to him by the Enforcement Directorate in connection with the money laundering case linked to the now scrapped liquor policy case. His party, AAP, said the matter was pending in court and said it would be heard on 16th March. It urged the Enforcement Directorate to wait for the court's decision instead of summoning repeated summonses. The party also said the Narendra Modilit Center should not create pressure like this, adding that it will not leave the opposition India bloc. Earlier, the probe agency issued the seven summons for Kejriwal, asking him to appear before it for questioning in the Delhi liquor policy case on 26 February. The Delhi chief minister has skipped all the enforcement directorate summonses, calling them illegal. Apart from the seven summons, the earlier six were issued on 14th February, 2nd February, 18th January, 3rd January, 22nd December 2023 and 2nd November 2023. On 17th February, a Delhi court allowed Kejriwal to appear before it physically on 16th March in connection with the Enforcement Directorate's recent complaint against him for skipping five summonses in the excise policy case after he cited a debate on a trust motion in the House. Addressing the court via video conferencing, the Chief Minister said that due to the confidence motion discussion in the Delhi Assembly and the budget session slated to end on 1st March he could not physically appear before the court. The AAP Supremo said he would be available to appear after 1st March. Following this, the court fixed 10 a.m. on 16th March as the next date for Kejriwal to physically appear before it. On 7 February, Kejriwal was asked to appear before the court after the Enforcement Directorate had filed a complaint against him on 3 February for not complying with the previous summonses issued to him in the liquor policy case. The court said the AAP Supremo was legally bound to comply. The complaint was filed under Section 174 of the IPC for non-attendance in obedience to an order from a public servant and Section 50 of the Prevention of Money Laundering Act. The Enforcement Directorate wants to record Kejival's statement in the Delhi Excise Policy 2021-22 case on issues like the formulation of policy, meetings held before it was finalized, and allegations of bribery. The probe agency claims that the AAP used kickbacks worth Rs 45 crore generated via the policy as part of its assembly poll campaign in Goa in 2022. The Delhi government had come up with an excise policy in 2021-22 aiming to revitalize the city's flagging liquor business by replacing the sales volume-based regime with a license fee for traders and promised swankier stores free of the infamous metal grills, ultimately giving customers a better buying experience. However, the policy was scrapped after Delhi Lieutenant Governor V.K. Saxena sought a CBI probe into the policy alleging irregularities. It was also alleged that a large chunk of this money was used by the party in its Goa election campaign.